the earphones, please? Can you remove the hat, please, the earphones? You got some sort of form of ID, please? ID? In my bag. Sorry? In my bag. Move Obviously. your bag, please. Move your bag. My colleague's going to search your bag. Is there anything here that's going to hurt me? Any sharps? Anything you should have? Any illegal substances? Sorry, sir, where were you coming from? I don't have to answer that, officer. You don't have to answer that. Okay, where are you heading to now? I don't have to answer that, officer. Okay, we have reports of somebody matching your description acting suspiciously in... Whoa, 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 whoa. What's going on here? Can you step over here, please, gentlemen? And no taking photographs or filming. Do you mind? Okay. Our colleague's going to search you now. Do you understand? Step over here, please. Okay, step over Excuse there. Excuse me. Step over here. Mohammed, are yeah, you all right there? Stand there. Stand there. Stand there. Pat you down, all right. Control. There's nothing in here, have you? A hey, Mohammed Anrawi. Anrawi. Take your shoes off. <laughs> shoes and socks, officer. Hey, tell him, man. What's going on? <laughs> Do you understand, bro? Control. Wilson, forget it. He's fucking job. What? He's a fucking copper. Why don't you tell us? Get in the car. <laughs> Wasting my fucking time. I'll see you back at the nick, yeah? You're not riding with your boys. Peace in Mohammed. Police training officer. <laughs> this is why pigs are forbidden, brother. <laughs> you get that one? <laughs> we don't do bacon. to the streets of Shabba. Reports of gang violence and street crime close to Shabba Town FC are sparking concerns that the historic being taken up by a new generation of young men in the area. What? This freedom. They pollute us, they poison us. Side by side with this country's freedom, we must carry our faith. Two Muslims walk into heaven. Place is teeming with wall, wall crumping. All dancing along to the beat of the call of prayer. All wearing burqas. Mohammed turns to Mohammed, he says, this is all right, mate. Mohammed turns back to him, he says, yeah, I don't fancy your 70 months. <laughs> I mean, be honest, what man here, if offered an eternity of bliss with 70 of heaven's most beautiful virgins, in return for jamming a stick of Semtex up your jacks, well, who wouldn't have that, eh? I would. I've got a stiff for the size of Big Ben here. In your dreams. See the new mosque got its planning permission then? And where are they sticking that? Only slap fucking bang next to Shadwell's football ground. Fucking shit! Well, what's that all about, eh? Ain't a new mosque we need round here. What we need is a new stadium for our football team. Any big team? Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's all very well selling out to a dodgy Russian billionaire. But can anyone here tell me what the fuck is the Europa Cup and how did we qualify for it? Look at your jug ears, pal. <laughs> You're funny. I'll tell you how we qualified for it, because we come top of the Fair Play League. A fair play? That's not what Shadwell's about, is it? Their supporters are from the poorest, most deprived part of the capital. For them, their team is their religion and they are feared throughout the land. Yeah. The question is, my friends, is does Volkovic really know what he's bought? I mean, Shadwell. We think Catanaccio is a frothy coffee, not a deep line Italian style defence. <laughs> my name's Izzy. Be glad yours is it. I right, thank you. What do you normally drink after a set? I usually drink a bottle of white wine. All right, bottle of your best and an orange juice, please, mate. A glass of orange juice. Yeah, cheers. Could you take it over? Yeah, For me. How about you, Jimmy? What's the cat?
Know who that is? That's Jerry Edwards. He used to play up front for Shadwell. Scored the goal that got us promotion to the old first division. Last time a couple bought me a drink was my retirement day. How do you know I was old Bill? You're joking, right? My name's Mohammed. Really? I've been put undercover at dogs. <laughs> An ethnic attached to the Shadwell firm. You're being set up, boy. So what made you join the building, eh? Got cops in the family? No. <laughs> totally against it. Dad hasn't spoken to me since. <laughs> What's funny? You. You and Trevor Clymer were on a crew together, right? <laughs> Clever Trevor put you up for this, has he? I hated that fucker. He was a bottler. Our team was in bits after Shadwell. Especially John. Listen, the best advice I can give you, and that's what you're here for, right? When you do bail out, do it on your own terms. Get him to retire you on medical grounds. I won't be bailing out. <laughs> Fucking hell, you are serious. Listen, forget it, man. All right? You're too straight. You've got to be able to bend and swerve. I can bend, I can swerve. I ain't that, and you've got the nuts for it. But Shadwell wise, you're totally fucking clueless, boy. I'm not straight off the fucking boat. I'm Shadwell, born and bred. Well, listen, grasshopper. First thing you're going to have to do, the most important thing you're going to do, if, if you're going to ride with a Shadwell, you're going to have to have a drink, aren't you? Jerry, have a glass over here, mate. Now listen to me. You're going to be offered Ease, Speed, Skunk, Rocks and Charlie. You'll be expected to chase every bit of skirt you can get near to. You will be expected to use the most obscene language imaginable to every race, religion and God there is. Oh, and there will be violence. And you will be expected to participate in it. What am I? You will drink like a dog. Fuck like a dog and fight like a dog. So you better leave that only book at home, Mohammed. And have that drink. Don't think. Do it. Fighting man, how are you? Should have slapped me back. You're round, I think, Mohammed. It's about getting your face known, getting trusted. Try too hard, they'll sash you. Once you're part of the furniture, trust me, they'll come to you. Just make sure you're there to take advantage. One full step and they'll have you, believe me. You'll be gone before you even started. So ease your way in. Get your face known around the manor. Come on, I'll buy you a drink. What are you having? Ross, can I get these two? The cheapest drink you've got. Pick the young targets, the ambitious ones. They're easier. Trust me. They'll lead you to the top dogs. The ones with the big bites. Yeah, yeah. Got a light, mate. Just when you get comfortable, you're in more danger than you know. I wish I hadn't seen that. When you make a connection, don't chase it. Back off. You'll want to go for it. 
Old back. Let days go by. Trust the connection. Table, same as everyone else. When it stays on. Fucking shots. Oh, look at that! Ah. You can put it in. You're wiping the floor with you, Danny Good. boy. You're gonna have that. No one does that, right, eh? He's gonna beat you, Danny boy. You watch yourself. Here we go, look. I've never seen you before. Just come here for a quiet game after the match. We're all shad boy, aren't we? I'll bite your fucking nose off. There's a couple of quid still on the table. Won't you boys play on for me, eh? <laughs> Fuck off. See you later, bud. Right. Where are you all gone, bud? Oh, he's all right. You don't even fucking know him, Gumbo. This is your moment. Dig deep. That madness in you, that rage, is your best friend. Use it. Bit, teeth, spill blood, give up everything for the cause.
This is what you've worked and planned for. The evidence that sends men down. Names and faces attached directly to actions. The rest is bullshit. Now you're doing your job. when you see who you really are. And you may not like what you find out, my friend. in England do just enough to get by if you're at by the back door. Fair play, Luke. Don't make me fucking laugh. Playing fair ain't the Shabwell way. You are right, though, Mojo? We think Catanasio is a frothy coffin. Well, the foreign mark fancy dance. I'm telling you, all they want to do is show themselves on the European stage, get a lug up to Spain, Italy, France. Meanwhile, ticket prices are fucking doubled. Jokovic is asset stripping, ain't he? I'm telling ya. End of the season, cashing his assets, sell a grant to developers. And we're back where we started, in the shit. You right, Vinny? Not really, Danny boy, no. When did we declare war on the North? Yeah, sorry about that, Vinny. We had some provocation we had to deal with. I, I didn't have time to phone. Mail there got done by the Northerners. Who? Uh, you don't know Mal, Vinny? Yeah, well, no one's introduced us, have they? Yeah, all right, all right. Let's see what you made of, then. Bread and butter. Pudding. Home. Englishman's cost. Football's coming. Home. No surrender. All right. Gotcha. Belgrano. Knick-knack. Packy-whack. Ooh, yeah, you're good, aren't you? Suck on this one. Inner Sharples. What? Inner Sharples, mate. Oilo, oilo. What's he on about? <clears throat> oilo. Of course you know, Gumbo. You know why? Cos you're an Englishman, ain't you? So am I, but I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Last chance. Rover's return in the snug. Ina Sharples and her mate. Old lady. Ina Sharples would share the snug at the Rover's return with her good friend, Minnie Caldwell. Their drink of choice, half a stout. <laughs> hey, right, did he get that right? He fucking did, did really? <laughs> God, you've done it, you've done it, son. Nice one. <laughs> I'm fucking on it, you know that? Why you drink, Willie? Really? Yeah. Sweet. Mate, she was so fucking selling it. Ah, she was lovely. <laughs> she was about 21 year old youth. Yeah, 20 years younger than you. Anyway, let's go. I don't want to be here anymore. I'll leave it out. Oi! What are you doing? Just tie my shoelaces. Fucking fast track. Immediate promotion, because you're a bit brown. Sir? Sir. Fuck off! Why me? Who do you think you're talking to? Sorry, sir. I couldn't help but wonder why you picked me for this assignment when you've got so many other special officers to pick. Well, your targets are very surveillance aware. They're not going to see you coming, are they? You're a packy. No one's going to suss you as Bill. They think we're all racist at the Met. Match day, nothing like nothing it. Nothing like it, Luke. Bust to the ground, pressed in with your mate. Say my car. Oh, I guess we'll get a bus. No. Well, a crack or the banner, three o'clock of a Saturday afternoon. Sunday? Well, Saturday, Sunday, it doesn't make a oh, difference. Kick off, I'll fucking run. 
full English and pints down the local boozer. Well, gastro pub. And it don't do full English no more. I, I, I like a bit of a little rock. <laughs> Wanker. Sorry, mate, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you get to a game this season, eh? Well, I'm saving up for Europe. Soon to get the ferry and get in a game at Sandman and it is to sit in a fucking kennel. Boys, live and up. This is the one and only time Shadwell are going to see anything of Europe. Amsterdam next round, for fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> and I have it on good authority that the S side are laying on a bit of a reception for our crew after the game. Should be tasty. Can we count you lads in? Of course you can, Vinny. Always up for it, you know that. Sweet. Well, just so long as we see some footy, yeah. <laughs> I'll get the rest in, yeah? Same again, lads. That fucking time. Cheers, bro. Cut it out, Danny boy. He's getting the drinks, isn't he? He's all right. Good as gold. What's in his rucksack? I don't know. He's always got it with him. Leave it out. What the hell? I'm not fucking handling it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Never trust one. No, I'll give it here. Hand it over. You sure? Eh? Good. Squeaky bum time, Nicky. Miami, I am truly fucking shocked. <laughs> 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 you dirty fucker. <laughs> yeah, no. Jesus fucking Christ. Look at you know what I'm fucking I'm having that time. <laughs> Stay here. <laughs> we'll see what you're made of in Amsterdam, are we? S-siders are a yig crew. Should be tasty for a packy like yourself. Yeah, I'm up for it, then, yeah. Yeah? Your windpipe is just about to cave. Yeah, babes? Yeah, I'm just outside. I got a mate with me. Sweet. You're invited to dinner. Alison Mohammed. Take his coat, babes. But whatever you do, don't look in his bag. No, you are. Right. He won't want a beer. <laughs> Mm -hmm. 
eight-year-old Bill. And you just confirmed it. One second of hesitation, one moment of doubt, and you've let them in. And then? Oh, don't be a twat. I'm undercover and all. No one told me you were coming. Are you on a case, though? I'll give you that. No one told me there was another team. No. You've heard of the extremism unit? Heard of them? Never seen one before. Mm-hmm. Operationally separate from the Met. Chances are, your control doesn't even know we're in. So what a special branch doing getting involved with football? Uh-uh, no. It's not football. Politics. Hey? I came in deep cover with Shadwell BMP. Times change, things happen. Moved on to the EDL. The dogs are just collateral activity. They're not my targets. You're hungry. Famished. You get me the salt? Yeah. I got my face known at the kennel. Started handing out leaflets, selling papers. Now I'm a trusted branch secretary, and I'm risking my crown jewels having a pack in my house. Well, it's a good thing you got guard dog, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, you talk the talk. Where's your gaff? Down by the docks of the Rock Kebab Shop. Well, look, I go where the politics are. And football only comes into it when we need a ready made army for hire. Have you got any fucking idea what you've walked into? Get that down, you. Skin and bone. There you go. Thanks, Dom. She's lovely. Don't take it to heart. I don't sweat it. Look in someone's eyes, I know the score. Most of the time, anyway. <laughs> How did you clock me? <laughs> I was on to you the minute I saw you. They're calling you around refs. Fuck me, I thought I was back in the Nick Canteen. Easy with the lingo, gringo. Look, anyone threatens my cover, and I'll do whatever I have to. You got it? All right. So you're going to Amsterdam, then? Yeah, I'm getting the coach with Nick and Danny boy. Yeah, well, you can cope with him. Just stay off my patch. I'll be busy cooking up some carnage. Thought I was on my own. Don't worry. You are. For this gun, yeah. Yeah. 50 euros, mate. Get your money out. Man. Get your Go fucking ahead. money out. There you go, son. For you when you get back, all right? Man, man, I'm from paradise. I'm fucking very bad. Exactly, baby. Break seats, mate. Gumbo. He's not married, is he? Fucking right, he is, mate. Two kids. Daft is in by all accounts. You should take him down a kennel. Been used to it. Do you know how much it costs to get your kids into a yeah, game these days? That's not even real. What's come up? It's not just tickets, is it? They want feeding, programs, shirts, all that shit. My old man used to get me in for a fiver. That's a few years before we died. He got me for the fucking okay. ticket. Yeah, but then you wouldn't be shut, would you? <laughs> yeah. What's your excuse? Dogs are the most for me. You fucked people. So are you then? 
Mas, Jihad, Saliban. Oh, my love. Oi, let's tune down, Mojo. How about you, mate? I've got my eye on that brunette looking number. What about you? Me? Mate? <laughs> No, no, listen, mate. Miami, come here. There ain't two ways about it. You've got to get stuck in. You've got to get that fucking little brown dick of yours wet, all right? Oh, it's Asian babes for you, isn't it? Come on, we'll go find you one. No, I think I'm all right. I think I'm all right. taken, mate. Fucking old school, yes, yeah, son. <laughs> <laughs> old school, eh? You dirty dog! Raise ya! <laughs> I'll take both of you. One of me face, one of me cock. So... Sorry. It's okay, I... Can we just talk? Yeah, we can talk. Is it because of your religion? No. Have a seat. I'm all right. All right. Sorry, I don't trust people. It's all right. I don't trust people either. How can you? But you just look nice and... Why did you come here? My mate set me up. Hmm. You look different, you know? No, they're my mates, yeah? Yeah, but they're there in the streets shouting, drinking, fighting, but you're not like that. Why would you want to be like that? Unconnected. They're just drifting. Yeah, they're the lucky ones. It's easy to get lost. How do I get lost? I can help you with that. Don't be afraid. <sighs> One is enough. Now close your eyes. I like the tunes. You like them? You got any Jefferson Starship? Son, come on, how'd you get on? Terrible. I never knew you could do it like that. <laughs> You dirty dog! Yeah, I'll smell that. For fuck's sake. I had myself an oxygen and Asian bitch. Oh, 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 Yeah. Time for one more, then we'll get in a taxi. All right, cool. Can I get three pints, please, and a bottle of bag? I've got something to set us up nice. Oh, yeah. No, I've already eaten, mate. You fucked up. Space cake. Ash. Oh, what? Mum. Open it up. We'll be with him. Fuck a taxi. We'll float to the match. <laughs> Fucking hell, man. What are we, no shows? 
Come on, we promised Vinny. Get up. Get up. I can't believe we missed the fucking game. Vinny will be going on fucking mental. <laughs> Fucking flares, me old Bill! Fucking dirty pigs! Come on, boys! Fuck off! Fucking hell, man! Finney! Finney! Where were you in a second world war, you fucking wanker? Why we fucking owe him? Boys, in the next race! Come on, come on, boys! Come on, you fucker! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Shadwell Town's first game in Europe was tarnished by trouble from its travelling support. Fighting between rival fans went into the early hours as the Dutch police struggled to contain the violence. The club has denounced the trouble and promised lifetime bans to any supporters convicted in Amsterdam. Vince has been arrested by the Amsterdam police. He's been arrested before. He'll sort it out. Or shouldn't we inform someone? Didn't even break cover when his mother died. Just to protect the integrity of his contacts. That's his priority. Why are you here? I got a bit fucked up. Guys with the territory. He seems immune. He comes back in bits sometimes. How does he cope? That's a good woman to sort him out. Don't. Just don't. Sorry. Actually, fuck it, I'm not. I'm going to sleep. You can stay till it stops. Babe, I'm outside. Got mates with me. I need to come in. All right, give me two minutes. I need to get some clothes on. Mo. Mo, you need to wake up. What? Wake up, Vinny's outside. You need to get out. Fuck. Oh, Vinny's outside. Oh, shit. The guy with the tattoos, I know him. He's a nutter by the name of Hunt. I put him down for five years on a GBH charge. You sure? How many people do you think look like that? All right, come on. Alright. What? Get out in the back. What? No. You got something a bit stronger, love? At eight in the morning. Thank you for letting us use your home. It's appreciated. Take a hint. So, listen, I was banged up yesterday with two of the leaders of Amsterdam's S side. Now, it turns out that they're in with a bloke who runs about 12 firms in Europe, Gervas van Bilden. Oh, yeah, I know him. 
He's got political clout and he can mobilise. Right. What are we talking about some Dutch geezer forward? My mum's got a fucking mosque up at Sailor House. Look, fire bombing, attacking jihadi stalls, confronting Muzzies wherever they are. See, that's where the war's won now. Find the ballot box. The closer UKIP gets to power, the tame they become. BMP is a memory, the EDL was in tatters. We can make our market. Yeah. The Dutch were offering knowledge. Connections, manpower. And is that going to put a stop to the mosque? But they need a stunt, don't they? If my contacts can say to Van Wilden, we know the guys who organise this. So, what do we need? How about this? What you got there, mate? What you reckon? Oh, fuck. Is that. Mm. Yeah, it's the real deal, all right. It's this peroxide. This battery backup's a mess, and the wire it. When did you put this together? This morning. That's what I thought. So we get with these crude online designs. This is exactly how lads blow themselves up in their back bedrooms. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is that on a timer? Is this running? No. It's going to blow in about three minutes. Oh, fuck. Fuck. Do you know how to diffuse that? No. Give it. Give it to me. Easy. That's extremely volatile, Vinny. Sorry. Oh, yeah. Leaving it at that. Am I fuck? Will you get off him? Get the fuck yeah. off him! He came round to tell me you've been arresting! Well, hold your horses. What's a packy fucking mozzy doing in your shed? Oh, what? Don't you keep one in yours? I'm not Muslim, I'm Sikh, can't you tell? Not really. You're all the fucking saint to me. Who the fuck told you to make a bomb? Wait around for you lot to do everything and push up the fucking daisies. Who are you exactly? He's with the lads. Come again? You heard. He's a Sikh. They fucking hate the jihad. I'm confused. Mohinder here, he's Shadwell, isn't he? He's in the same crew as Nick and Danny Boy. The wannabes? Yeah, all mates together, that's right, isn't it, Mo? Hey? Shoulder to fucking shoulder on the fucking terraces, fucking meat pie in one hand, bother in the fucking other. Isn't that right, Mo? Hey? Shadwell for life. Yeah. Shut it. What's he doing in your shed? Well, if you don't mind, lads, I think I need to talk about that in private with the missus. Fair enough. And as for you, you whoa, backstabbing whoa, whoa, fucking whoa, 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 whoa. bastard! Don't throw your ace away. EDL used to like dark faces in the media. It emphasises that Islam is the enemy, not race. You run with the dogs, yeah? Fancy a chance of taking on the Muzzies? They've pissed on my people long enough. Yeah. Put your fucking trousers on. Get me out. I'm still confused. Fucking unbelievable, aren't you? What did I say to you? I said, back off, stay clear, leave well alone. And what you do? You show up at my house for a secret meeting of EDL top brass. I know, you could kick him on that. Fuck off, all you had to do was lie down and take it. All right. All right. <laughs> Who's that we take it? Oh, yours, Danny Boy. Right oh, yeah. Look at how you dirty dog. <laughs> Whoa. You were a dirty dog in Amsterdam, I heard. 
Have you been selling tails out of class, Mojo? I'll see you at a match. I've got to see a dog about a man. <laughs> We got an opportunity here. We need someone we can control to front us. Time to play the packy card. Let's go. So that's right, isn't it? You got the tickets? The tickets you got. Ah! Oh, fucking <laughs> pass it. Yeah, mate. You love me. Come on, what the fuck are you wearing? Bro? Oh, come. Clear pay for real football. I ain't putting any more money in Vokovic's pocket. Put me out here with this. He wants to put up to the prize, isn't he? Yeah, mate. Here's your ticket. Keep your money in your pocket. No, but it's not the point, Danny boy, is it? It's just got us over a fucking barrel. Someone's taking a piss. Come on, mate. Come on, just come here and wipe their feet on our fucking door, man. Here we go. You too. Nothing. Fish said. Evening, mate. Good afternoon. Nice shirt, by the way, man. Oh, thanks, and? mate. Shall I have some tickets or what? What? You want some tickets, man? You come here. Our country. Our manor, our grand, and you ain't even got fucking tickets. Come on, man, sell us the... Sell us. Oh, I want to sell you my tickets for all the team. Hey, 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 Fucking hell, Nick. There we go. All right. Good luck, man. Good luck, man. Yeah. See you later. Right. Right round. I hope we fucking hammer you. We'll be all right. There was two minutes ago. Come on, we can do it, boy. Come on. That's the third chance the Argentinian forward has let go begging to do it. Fucking hell. Is Shadwell ever going to score this goal that would take them into the next round of the Europa Cup? Here they come again, the young Italian dashing down the wind. He Not you. Mojo! A word. to the lift.
Thanks. How many miles were you running before injury? About 12 miles a day. Struggle getting up the stairs in the morning. I don't even <laughs> manage that. It's like having toothache in your legs. <laughs> Would you excuse me a second? Yeah. How did you get in here? Why didn't you tell me that Special Branch are in at Shadwell EDL? Not here. I don't have any access to that information. I won't slap into him, he's shooing me off. Well, can you blame him? Which is a bit of a problem, seeing as I've been adopted as bait for a march against Shadwell Mosque. Who gives a fuck about that? You're supposed to be tracking football games. With all due respect, sir, you put me on site without backup, without relevant information about other operations happening in the same turf. Shit gets messy, but then what would you know about it anyway, eh? Sitting behind your desk. Hmm? <laughs> You're finished. You think I'm some suit who knows fuck all. And what the fuck? has this got to do with building relationships with your own targets? If things go political, they'll be on the front line. I can nail all of them. How long have I got? As long as Shab will stay in Europe. To be honest, I thought they'd be out on their arse first round. How's a new kid doing, the little eye tie? I ain't got a clue, I ain't seen a match. Well, what the hell have you been doing? Compiling a detailed database of individuals, meetings, discussions, including conspiracy to cause public disorder, including a demonstration on the mosque, which I don't want to get involved with. Because you bottled it. It might actually give you a little bit of credibility. I grew up going to that mosque. They know full well that I'm a police officer. I risk breaking my cover, especially as I can't even back out without drawing attention to myself. Listen, son, don't worry about the march. My boys will look after you. Yeah. Oh, this is DC and Rawi, one of our brightest prospects. Sir? You stick with your targets and you leave the political stuff alone. And I still want to know about the little eye tie. So he's a prospect, is it? Oh, not like in our day, eh? Don't worry about him. You mark my words, he'd be out on a medical in six months. See you again, PC Mohammed. That's DC Mohammed. I've been promoted, brother. You remember her? Allah Akbar. Allah Akbar. Sami Allah, Liman Hamida, Allah Akbar.
side by side with this country's freedom, we must carry our faith. Side by side with this nation's equality, we must walk with profit. Have you had any more trouble from the right wingers? No more excrement through the post than usual. Coexisting. The planning to hit the new mosque our host. next Friday. But what? This freedom. And you're here to tell us this. Britain got talent. There'll be 15, 20 of them tops. On TV. You boys can more than double that. Your children home from school. How could your info? Should be studying. I'm here, aren't I? Praying. Well, we'll deal with this. Because the police don't do anything. We need to show some force. Show them we ain't going anywhere. Pushed like drugs at our people. We can put them on display then, can't we? They pollute us. They poison us. If we put on an act, television, is that blasphemy? Internet, We're protecting the profits, honour. Lifestyle magazines. I think that'd be all right. I can't be involved. This is Kafir's freedom. In the name of Allah, your father sat over there. This is Kafir's democracy. I don't know that man. This is Kafir's equality. And he doesn't know me. This is the freedom of Kafir. You know, you are welcome back here. The community's changing. Not quick enough. The only true freedom is in sacrifice to Allah. Vinny. He's not here. I can hardly go to A&E, can I? All right. Oh, right. Turn around. See the other one. Okay. Right. Isn't adultery a sin for you? A nice Muslim girl next door to make the parents proud. There was. Didn't work out. Didn't work out for who? How long have 
long did you leave it before you let her down? You're hurting. Sorry. You don't break someone without breaking yourself. Found that out. That's good. I don't have to break you. It's already been done. You're not worried about Vinny? Yeah, I'm worried about Vinny. I'm not worried enough, obviously. <sighs> this is what went long ago. He starts wearing his socks in bed. Makes you wonder. He could walk in on us and... I can't we... hear this. All about the hunt, is that it? He's a fellow cop. I can't do it to him. It's me you could have done it to. What's that on it, Scott? We're on our way to a match. All the crowd are going to go there. We're going to go straight. You fucking squeaky bastard. All right, lads. All right, lads. How long have you been out here? Mug, you missed the ramble at the mosque. We're the only blokes to get arrested, how come? What's the problem, Danny boy? I'll tell you what my problem is. You never get stuck in. Takes a few knocks and then bails out. He's never there when it kicks up. Danny <laughs> boy, He turns up out of nowhere. He wants to know everybody's business and he conveniently gets arrested when the shit hits. And what's more, he's fucking been his missus. Oh, oh, that's my... Oh, oh, right, shut it! That's my fucking business, isn't it? Problem? Sorting it, Dave. Strip. That's right, strip. Bit cold for that, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> What is it you're looking for, exactly? Cameras, mics. What? <laughs> <laughs> He's one of them undercover filmmakers. My brother went down on video evidence made from an undercover dog maker. Anything? No, there's nothing here. Nothing? No. So? I'll tell you something. If he's not a journal, he's something even worse. He's a fucking muzzy. What have you got to say? Oh, Danny boy, oh, mate, you got one there. You don't fucking subscribe. <laughs> his Muslim's Jewish on his mother's side. We hate yids. No, we don't. What? No, that's the BMP. The BMP hates yids. Why the BMP? Exactly right. We really ill now. No, no, we're not. Hey, we love Israel. Huh? Our enemy's enemy is our friend. Do try to keep up, you fucking wanker. Stone me, documentary maker, Mazza, you'll be saying he's a copper, eh? Like, like Jolly yeah. Triff. Jolly Triff, we're copper. Yeah. Gumbo, just get the drinks in, will ya? Yeah? Oh, so? Yeah, go on. Oh, oh. Yeah, Dave. Dave. It's a shame, man, eh? Yeah, it's about safe to be sorry, Dave. Yeah, yeah. Alright, man. Clean as a whistle.
raise your arm. Oh, can you trust Elo to raid the mosque? I mean, that Danny boy's keen. He's too keen. Yes! Back's against the wall. I don't want to show off. Little twat doesn't even realize that Muslims are circumcised. He's no use to us. Beanie will round up the runts of the litter, pack them off to the game. Don't include the fucking Jackie. Some of the scariest fuckers I've met in this movement have been ethnics. Maybe it's self-hatred, maybe they just feel they need to prove themselves by trying harder. Right, gumbo. Yeah, hot bag, so soup. Yeah, lovely. Hot bag, then, bunch of. Oh, that's nice. We got a welcoming committee. Got a blade. I'll tell you, pig. Terrible. How'd you find me? Benny followed you the night he brought you home. Not much of a homemaker, are you? <laughs> Present. He asked the specials to give them everything they had on you. He's watching your back. <laughs> That's nice of him. Get out while you can. The nasties were sat around my kitchen table, saying they needed a martyr to the cause. And your name came up. No. What did Vinny say about that? Has to appear to go along with it, or they'd be looking at him. Uh, two for the price of one, eh? Gets in with his fascist mates and gets rid of the competition as well. All right, come on. What they got in store for me, eh? Come on. Because I'll take anyone on. What you like a battle, do you? Want to take on the Metropolitan Police, the English Defence League, and special. Bro <laughs> yourself doing the school run. Yeah. Why not? Me and you. 
house in the suburbs, kids, you go to work, I pick them up. And laws, friends, late night cocoa. I don't mean cocoa. <laughs> do you? <laughs> Take a look at yourself. Oh. Oh, you could play the part. Pay the mortgage on time. But you'd still be undercover. Be another job, another disguise. Isn't that what everyone does, huh? Plays the part. I wasn't playing just now. But no, you need to get out. You need to go today, now. Mm. No, 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 there's no Mo. Mo's someone I created. I just killed him. My name is Mohammed. And I'm seriously fucking mad. Now you watch me burn. This, this cannot be allowed to happen. Do I want to open the pork butchers in Karachi? I mean, what the fuck are you doing here? You don't like us, we don't like you. Here's your fear. Fuck off. This mosque will open. The old one then. Take a hit. Let us have our splash. We'll give you good warning. You take the front page headlines, we get sympathy and extra funds from the council. We're not against politics. Oh, we got language in. I'm gonna have to discuss that with my brothers. Nothing's that simple. Me, I just get on with it. You talk to who you have to. Boys, one guy will do us. Oh, European, no, nothing like it. Hot dog stalls, car alarms, police sirens, smell of testosterone. Shut up, Nick, no one's to fucking know. Pills and frills, Nicky boy. What the fuck are you doing? Save me one for gumbo. He won't mind. You greedy fucker. Enjoy the match. I'm needed elsewhere. <laughs> Seriously, mate, look, look. He's up to something. What's he fucking doing with him, innit? Fucking flesh car. You ready for your big moment? The old mosque is going to take a hit, and you are going to deliver it. Only you can get in without being noticed. Don't worry, son. We got you covered. Going to time it for the final whistle before the crowd's out of the match. Streets will be empty. You'll have a clear route. Nick, Don't make a stand, Nick. He's putting up ticket prices again. Wants to change the fucking name, Canary Wolf Panthers or something. We're going to boycott every home game starting tonight. What's the quarter final? Don't matter, mate. We've got to make a stand, Dean. It's the biggest game in our history, Gumbo. No, man, no, fuck it. I'm going in. You're missing the point, Danny. All right, make room, you fucking anorex. Come on. <laughs> 
haven't seen a fucking game this season. OK, so Hunt has something that we want you to deliver to your friends at the mosque. Simple. Good job. There's a lot to be said for these old school designs, you know. George, is it armed? I'm just saying it now. All right, we're on. Easy. Get yourself ten yards clear when it blows, or it'll be mo fucking kebab. All right, all right. Steady. Dave, give us a hand. Fuck off. You want it done properly or not? Come on, let's do it. Easy. Oh, for fuck's sake. There we go. Don't worry, son. You're not on your own. George will be following you every step of the way. What you waiting for? Too many people around it, it's not safe, okay? You make sure nobody follows me because it's not safe. Do you understand? We're good, sir. Alright, good. Alright, we're not getting a badge. Promise. Don't you worry, Dad. Don't you worry. I'll put your back. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Fuck it. He's a couple, by the way. Fuck, I put me down. And I might have used a bit more of the explosive that I planned. He's going to need more than 10 yards. Anything within 100 yards is going to be dust. You won't be missed. I'm going to get down to the ground. Blend in with the plebs. Don't you worry your pretty little head. One call to Taliban HQ will get them out of the way. It's on. Everybody up, please! Yeah, you with him? Yeah. He's a copper. When he's at the mosque, take him out. The bomb will do the rest.
Where's the bomb? Where's the fucking bomb? It's out there! Well, I'll put some more in there just for you. Breathe, just fucking breathe. Now, the only thing that matters is that I keep my cover. You don't know the half of what I'm on to. All right? Did you fucking sleep with her? I don't expect we'll be seeing you around here again. Shit, where the fuck is it? When did you set this timer for? Now. Now. This now. When nothing's fucking happening. You fuck. Tensions in London's East End area have erupted with a mystery explosion at the home of Shadwell Town Football Club, with one fatality believed to be the bomber. Police rely on CCTV footage to identify the suspect, one Garth Berry. Well known and respected within his local community, Berry was best known as Gumbo. No other suspects are believed to be involved, a police spokesman saying this looked like a lone wolf protest against plans to develop the Shadwell ground. So, Volkovich decides on the eve of a European semi that he's selling our team to the Saudis. Cheers, mate. There's not a lot to say in the face of that. They're Russians, Arabs, they're not like us, are they? We have got to hang on to the true spirit of the Englishman before we forget what that is. Right. Now, you know a true Englishman three ways, by his attitude to drinking, food and sex. <laughs> Apparently now, chicken tikka masala is our national dish. I mean, what happened to good old English fish and chips, I hear you ask? Well. The chips idea we imported from the French, and the fried fish we got from the Jews. So you see, it never really was English at all. But the vinegar, that was all ours. That's right. We added the sour bit. How English is that? I do miss me pie and mash shops, though. I mean, down my road, we've got curries, kebabs, Italian, galau. But I want me pie and mash and liquor. Sums up everything that does about a true Englishman. Pie, mash and liquor. And right there, you have the Englishman's Guide to Saturday Night Sex. You have five points, match of the day, climb on top when you can't get it up. So it's pints, match, and liquor. <laughs> I'm Eddie, really big lad, you're not. <laughs> no, thanks, mate, I'm off it. What'd I say to you? Hey? I said, don't end up like John. Climber tried to retire me. Can't get rid of me that easily, got promoted. Well, you might make a cop of you. Being reassigned. Extremism unit. I do fucking good police work. I found that out the hard way. As a man? How are you doing now? 
Still working on that one. And we all. You'd be all right. Two out of three ain't bad. <laughs> How do you mean? You're a good copper. And a decent bloke. But I'll tell you something, don't we, man? You ain't much of a Muslim. Gumbo. Fucking love you, Gumbo. You're learning. I do not condone or excuse what happened at Shadwell, but I understand it. I understand the power and the depth of feeling that caused that to happen, because I feel the depth and power of that feeling myself, and many people do. And it won't be the last time. Thank you.